This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button while the streets are talking. And Jay Prince and his family are, they're not doing well in Houston. Uh, they used to be go running around claiming they run Houston. Uh, they were, Jay Prince is always going to be respected in Houston. The Suns aren't going to be as much anymore. I'm going to be honest with you because um, that memorial really turned people's uh turn people around a lot the memorial they put up didn't even have takeoff's name and flowers it was a memorial to remind people that h-town infinity the prince family it didn't say uh anything about takeoff there was a little plaque and a couple pictures of takeoff below it and uh jay prince you know put out replacing fear with uh courage is how you become you know, nobody can mess with you you know I don't, you know, he's putting out really cryptic messages, and uh, people in Houston just aren't messing with the Prince family anymore. They just, they're really disgusted by everything that's going on. I mean, that's just what's going on. I, I, you know, don't, don't don't shoot the messenger. You know, this is just what's going on. People, you can see under all these posts of the of the memorial, people were disgusted. Um, here is some people talking about it. Oh, Houston, like that. Everybody, why you think Sauce Walker don't give up? Why you think Trey don't claim that it's Slim Thug? Everybody from somewhere else. Mm, yeah. But yeah. everybody yeah. know about all these boogeyman stories. And it ain't been no situation. Just be thinking because we got money. There's some type of Frank White, El Pacino. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to say, someone sent me a message talking about, you know, he's locked in with the with the people, like the government and all, like he, like he, you know what I'm saying? Like, the yeah, like some mafia, like, like he got the politicians on payroll type. Like, How he like, know that? Mafia, like, he he was right now. Like he was watching power. Hold on, you said he got police with rap a lot change. You mean? Like you gonna catch a police in a in a regular uniform with a rap a lot change? Oh, you, oh, Hold you on, did. who from Texas in here? Who from he Texas? Really in here? He the cartel, huh? Any Texans <laughs> in here? Jess Dream, what's up? You from Dallas, right? No, I'm from West Texas. Oh, that don't come. No, what's that? West Texas. What you mean? What part? North Abilene. Yeah, he out the way. With Abilene, like like Abilene. Riverside, Moreno Valley, it's like that. Hell no, Abilene like Muff Baker. Baker what, you been through here before? What? I've been through the whole Texas a million times. 10 to 20 to 30, 45 to 1960s and all the rest of the motherfucking highways. Oh, you've been, yeah. been out here. You've been straight through Houston on 1960. <laughs> hey, you was right, bro. You was right. All right, about what? I remember, I remember. I'm from Houston. You remember we talked last week? Remember? Okay. Remember when I was, you know, I was, you know, I was, I was. Look, I'm a man of my word. I was on here trying to take up for Houston. That's my city. And they, hey, they did this some hoe. They printed this some hoe for that, bro. The John TV said that's my. Oh, what said. happened? No, he was one up, up here battling me you know, some pro Houston. I say, bro, this ain't on Houston, and it just happened to be from Houston. But he was also pro Houston that, uh, <laughs> you, know, you know, I he busted. I guess he busted. He must know something. If he out there, he must Houston, know something. see what he's saying is letting you know what the temperature that's is. That's a right fact. Now. That's what it is. That's why I know what you know. Now, nah, man, shit. I'm just, I'm just being real. I mean, you know, Houston, my city, and like that's making us look bad. You know, like, I'm deep. You know, I'm blood. You know, oh that's yeah, I remember you. I remember him. He was on stage. Yeah, that's all I want to say, fam. That's all. He was the one that been on tour with them. Went to man. tour. He was hung out with. Him. He was like, knew him, huh? No, he was. He was. Yeah, he had. Uh, he, he. I remember he was up here like a couple of days ago, last week or something. Uh huh. And he was saying that um, he with him before and how some some some. Yeah. Remember. Yeah, he would have been there if he like he 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 could have been there like some shit. He was, but he yeah, didn't. He wasn't yeah, there. Yeah. yeah, but he didn't go. Yeah, he yeah. So I feel my the you know, like I feel that. So check in with the ribs at, you know. I'll let be some louse. Like they felt like that's some scams, some louse. You feel me? Like for real, for real. They they ain't like us. They ain't original. He got the worst in the street. You know, I'm standing on that. They, that's my whole making Houston look bad. You know, what part ain't nothing like that. There's some players down here. So you, you, you know, the crazy here. part is he right because that should give Houston a, a bad stigma when it comes to coming down that way. And what he's saying is that ain't what it is down here. That, that's isolated with them. That's what he's saying. Hey, but do 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 Brody know any know any real from the big war? He, like, know he know them because I think. I believe he. I know a lot of people down here, sir. No, I'm talking about just from the fifth ward, from where they from. You might know yeah, some real. Yeah, it's some, some real. 
it's some real stiffness out there. I'm not saying no, like they, like just behind, like if I'm big OG general, you know what I'm saying? Like all might as well go under me. I got some that, like, you know, that's not gonna say nothing unless I make the call. If I'm there, it don't matter if I'm there or not there. Like, you know, just come on. Like, a that ain't fact. That, that is a like, fact. No, I'm just, I'm just asking, like, if you any real from Pilgrim that don't really, that be, because, you know, they be screaming that shit. Yeah, like a is lot that, of niggas are screaming, but they just be screaming, but they ain't it. You feel me? Like, a lot of niggas don't do that. A lot of people don't just, I'm you know, they mob, I'm you know, they tired, you know. Yeah, you know. Is that the guy that came in here and said uh, his guy the one that took his chain or something like that? Jay Prince took the chain? No, I, it's probably different. I, yeah. yeah, so Jay Prince is a man that uh, built an empire and he had many, you know, he had a couple sons. But the way Jay Prince Jr. is handling things and probably Jazz Prince with this whole memorial and everything around the takeoff thing. Um, and then you add in all the things that happened the past two years with Jay Prince Jr. trying to press this person and that person and commanding respect and saying, do you know who my daddy is and all that? It's like, eh, starting to rub people the wrong way. Jay Prince is a man that has done so much. He deserves his respect, you know. Um, but it's hard. He has sons, you know. He, you're always going to stand for your sons, you know. I don't know, man. Uh We'll see how it all shakes out. I just noticed a lot of chatter going on. But uh, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. I appreciate you guys. And I hope you guys have a great evening and morning. And I'll check you guys later. Peace.